Clutter Coach. My team and I help families and businesses cut the clutter, get organized, and lead a more productive and stress-free life. Come along on our journey as we help our clients and find the motivation you need to make positive changes in your life. This is Organization Motivation. Organization Motivation brought to you by J.K. Lumber. Closed captioning provided by Forever, the world's first permanent online photo storage and sharing service. Hi, I'm Deb Cabral, the Declutter Coach. Welcome to this episode of Organization Motivation. Well, you may recognize the scene behind us. We are actually at the home of our client, Stephanie, and we were here early in the year organizing and decluttering her beautiful kitchen. Well, today, the mission is the bathroom. Beth, it's pretty bad. Yeah, it's really bad. Well, we're excited. We're going to introduce you again to Stephanie, and we're going to work on her bathroom to get it completely organized and get rid of a lot of toiletries that she doesn't need anymore. I'm so excited to have Devin and Betsy back again. Um, we redid our bathrooms, and this is our master bathroom, and we did it probably about a year ago, but then we never really organized it afterwards. We just pulled everything out, boxed everything up, and just never dealt with it again and just use some things. I don't think I really have the best organization in there. The other day I cut myself and for the life of me I couldn't find a band-aid. I didn't know where to look. So I don't think, even though I've tried to organize, I don't think I really know where all the things are. And then I go out and buy things over and over again because I just did it and now I found out where it was. So I'm excited that she's here and I'm excited to get it organized because it's a really nice bathroom. I'm really excited and I love it. Even though it's disorganized, I know where some of the things are in my makeup drawer. It may not be organized, but I know where the things are um, but if I'm scrambling to try to find something, sometimes I can't always find it. This morning I was trying to find, uh, I don't know, some kind of jewelry cleaner and I didn't exactly know where that was. So I have some organization, but probably not enough. I'm sure not enough. I try to keep things in the area where they're used, but I probably, probably now that we pulled some more things out of the closet, it's probably not all where it should be. Like I try to keep bathroom products by the tub, you know, things close to that. Um, I don't know, I have a big cabinet over the, the toilet, but it's really not being used well up there either. So there's a whole bunch of areas that probably aren't being used well. Okay, so I'm sitting in Stephanie's bathroom, and it's a beautiful bathroom, but there's a lot of stuff around. So we're gonna hopefully find a place for everything and have Stephanie get rid of a lot of excess stuff that she has, like we all do, every scent lotion you can think of, every type of first aid thing you can think of. Some of it needs to go, but the rest of it we're gonna find a home for. So when you first walk in the bathroom, you know, it really doesn't look that bad. There are some extra things on the countertops, which we all have in our homes. But it's really when you open up the cabinets and the drawers that you see extreme clutter. And all the time that Stephanie's wasting every day to try to find what she needs to get ready in the morning. So our goal is to make it neat and organized and make her more efficient and get her out the door quickly in the morning. The game plan for Stephanie's bathroom is this. We are going to clear all of the surfaces and go into every single drawer and cabinet. She's got a lot of storage in here, but I just don't think she's utilizing it the best that she can. And I think there's a lot of things that probably have expired or just really need to go. I'm really excited that our friends at the Container Store donated some great products to use in Stephanie's bathroom today. Come on board and watch us declutter Stephanie's bathroom. Well, we are about to get started. Stephanie, thanks for coming back to the show. Thank you for having me. We're really excited. We're doing this beautiful bathroom today. And as Betsy said, you know, it's gorgeous in here. It's just we've got a lot of things that really we need to go through, make sure that you're using everything. I think we have 400 different lotions and shampoos and a lot of those, you know, just probably need to be, you know, moved on and tossed. So we'd like to start left to right, as you remember. So this is your makeup area. And what I'd like to do is start um, with the countertop and then we're going to go into the drawers and the cabinets. But what we thought would be a great idea, we have such a big room here to play with. Don't go away. We'll be right back. Follow us on Instagram at The Declutter Coach. 